Problems of infertility are growing day by day. Professionals treating the problems are in great demand and less in number. Garbhagnyan, the unique and ambitious dream project of hospital Garbhagudi, aims to train professionals in enhancing their skills on various issues from diagnosis till proper sensitive treatment of infertility. And once Garbhagudi was launched and after around 7 years with huge success rates, what I noticed was this knowledge about the reproductive health has to percolate to the students who are interested in practicing infertility. And whenever they opt for a center, that center should give them end-to-end -end solution from theory, practical, hands-on, handling complications, embryology, everything completely compactly presented in a nutshell into one beautiful course. When I made lot of thoughts on that, I understood it has to be named appropriately to Garbhagudi and this beautiful coinage came as Garbhagnan. As the name Garbhagnan indicates, information regarding pregnancy and available treatment options are explained in detail by team of experts, leading to detailed training all under the same roof. Because the doctors are all into their busy practices, they cannot devote a lot of time into courses, but they want to have knowledge on this. So I have made weekend courses, weekly ones courses, where they can have their own practice as well as fellowship courses here. It's for uh, planned for one year course, where there will be weekly one session. Also practicals, also theory, everything will be covered for them. Complete the course in one year. And the end of one year, they'll give a, get a accreditation and from a IMA, which is very, very valid for them for the outside practice. If they're not able to spend one year, they have a lot of short-term courses, either for 15 days, one month or six months. Many courses are there. Apart from the courses for the doctors, many courses have been planned for embryologists, andrologists, cryopreservation, FET techniques. Many courses are there which you can get all the details to Garbhagnan website. Globally recognized standard is maintained while people are getting trained. Using uniquely designed advanced technological system and support helps trainees gain apt knowledge as that of surgery. To leverage technology to train the doctors, the other aspect is to use medical simulators. When I say medical simulators, these are virtual reality based simulators where the participant or the student works in a completely immersive uh, situation like for example if somebody is to be trained in a surgery they will go through a VR process where they will wear a headset with audio background to it and the simulation of an operation theater is complete they will be able to experience the operation theater scenario completely and they will be able to go through the pickup process or the embryo transfer process and learn everything and they are allowed to make mistakes because there are no live patients here once the mistakes are done, the system will clearly tell them where they made a mistake, what they are good at, where they need to learn better and then they can rerun those scenarios. Scenarios can be tailor-made to teach each student about their lacuna, where they have gaps in their knowledge, etc. Those interested can undergo this training irrespective of the country in which they are from or they live in. Good response is being received for this useful training. See, the advantage of technology being used in uh, Garbhagnan is it makes it easy for uh, the global audience. Maybe a doctor sitting in Somalia can run through the complete scenarios, may be able to run through the complete course online for about a month or so and then come here and do a hands-on program just for two days. There are certain programs where if there is a no need for hands-on program, the complete course can be handled for, by a doctor or an embryologist without even visiting our facility. This makes us uh, able to reach out to the global audience very effectively and easily. The course is being approved by IIMA. Rajiv Gandhi University affiliation will be received shortly. To train people in reproductive health, we have conducted many CMEs in Bangalore, wherein many faculties from all over the world and India have come to this CME and nearly about 2,000 clinicians have been trained in this. No doubt, Garbhagnan will be pioneer in bringing changes and improvement in many lives.